Okay, now this is question number two of the same paper, which is November 2020, 9709 component 51. This is S1, A level maths, question number two. The probability that a student at large music college plays in the band is 0 0.6. Is 0 0.6. For a student who plays in the band, the probability that she also sings in the choir is 0 0.3. For a student who does not play in the band, the probability that she sings in the choir is zero is x. The probability as a, uh, that a randomly chosen student from a college does not sing in the choir is 0 0.58. Now remember what this 0 0.58 is representing. That's representing a student from the college does not sing in the choir. So does not sing in the choir is this, and does not sing in the choir is this. So I've drawn a probability tree diagram over here. For questions like this, it's always a good practice to draw a tree diagram. So you have the possible outcomes over here. Sings in the, is in the band, which is 0 0.6. It's not in the band, it's gonna be one minus 0 0.6. So that's gonna be represented as B complement, which is 0 0.4. If she is in the band and she sings is 0 0.3. If she is in the band and does not sing, that's gonna be 0 0.7 is not in the band and she sings is given as X. If she's not in the band and does not sing is given as one minus X, since the total probability has to add up to one. Now I have this as, if like the question says, the probability that randomly chosen student from the college does not sing in the choir is 0 0.58. So I've taken this as she is in the band, but does not sing, and she is not in the band and does not sing, which is equal to 0 0.58. So all we have to do is just plug in the properties. So we have B as 0 0.6 multiplied by it's not in the it does not sing, which is 0 0.7, plus it's not in the band, 0 0.4 being multiplied by and does not sing, which is 1 minus x is equal to 0 0.58. So if I can have a bigger bracket over here and this within the bracket. This is important and it has to be within the bracket because 0 0.4 is going to be multiplied by one and minus X both. So if I solve this 0 0.6 into 0 0.7, that's going to give me 0 0.42 plus 0 0.4 multiplied by one, that's going to give me 0 0.4 minus 0 0.4 multiplied by X, that's going to give me 0 0.4 x minus 0.4x is equal to 0.58. If I solve this, I will be getting this as 0.24 is equal to 0.4x and x is equal to 0.6. That's the probability. That's part one done. Part two, two students from the college are chosen at random. Find the probability that both the students play in the band and both sing in the choir. So if they both play in the band and sing in the choir, so it's going to be 0 0.6. That's the probability for being in the band and also sing in the choir is 0 0.3. And remember, there are two students selected. So that's the probability of student one multiplied by the property of student two. And the properties are such that the student is in the band and also sings. That's for student one, multiplied by ends and. So find the property that both students play in the band and both sing in the choir. So this is student one and the same goes for student two, has to be in the band and also sing. So that's student two. So we are going to do exactly the same properties multiplied by each other. So 0 0.6 times 0 0.3 multiplied by 0 0.6 times 0 0.3 again, that's going to give you 0 0.0324. The answer has to be 3 SF and that's your answer. Now remember please, once you're doing these questions, it's always a good practice if you can have a look at the question, pause the video, Try to do the question on your own and then look at the solution. If you're just going to listen and do it, and it's not like storytelling or something, so you won't really get anything.
So practice is very important. You have to do the questions on your own. You can pause the video, read the question, try to solve the question. If you can't do it that way, then read the question, have a look at this solution, and then pause the video and then try the question on your own. But you have to try it on your own. Only watching the videos won't help that much.